Welcome back, welcome back. I picked up another um, pair of cactus plecos to add to the fish room. I seen these a um, couple, well, about a week ago on Happy's Fish Online and uh, got in contact with Ross and decided to make the purchase. And as you can tell from the thumbnail, I picked up a male and female L185 Black Dragon Cactus Pleco. And so I've been wanting to get these for a minute here. And as always, he packages them really, really well. I can tell these are double bag and then he puts a plastic container in the second bag so that the Pleco can't uh, bust the bag open. So very nice. That one is alive. And this one is alive. All right. Well, let's get these out the back so we can take a better look. Let's go down to the fish room. I'm gonna have to get my gloves on as well because Black Dragon Plecos have those spikes on, on them, the armor all through their bodies, and I don't wanna stab myself with it. So after I get this open, I'm gonna get my gloves on. And let's take a look. Not easy to get out, but i uh, get it out of here. Now, black dragon cactus plecos too have teeth. Um, so I don't want to get bit by that, those teeth either, so. All right. Got it, got it. Here's the first one. And I think this is the male, if I'm not mistaken, because he said the male had more of the shreddedness on the fins, the back fin, which will all grow back in time. Very dark. Right. Let's grab the other one. And I think this one is the female. So these are young, so they way too young to breed at this point, I think, but let's add them to the tanks. I'm gonna have both of these in the same tank. Just gonna have a divider in there. Gonna treat them. Let them, get, let them get used to each other, seeing each other. And then I'll set up another tank, a bigger tank for them in the future. And they're probably gonna do like my last pair of cactus plecos, being in the divided tank, they grew all their fins back. And when I add them, I added both of my um, L025s to the big tank, I mean, they had full finish uh, streamers going all way, going all down their body. So, and the same most likely is going to happen here as well. So, they look good. Are doing well. All right. Happy to add these to the tank in my collection, and I'll probably do future videos and showing how they're doing. But you know, let's go back and take a look here since I got the camera. I was going to take a look at the tank with the L025 Super Reds, Cactus Plecos. One is a Super Red, one is not. And take a look at those, see how they're doing. Remember, I was concerned because I had them divided so long. I wondered how they were going to adapt to being in a big tank together, and they are doing well. Now, what I'm starting to figure out, I'm, I can tell, I know for a fact that the big female. The big one in there is a female, without a doubt. I took her out, examined her, her whole body shape, everything is 
in her size. Look at her trailers. You can see how long they all grew back and she is in great condition. For a fact, I know she's a female. Now, the male, I'm not too sure. I think he may be a male, just young, but both of these are showing um, the same kind of traits as a female mother tanks. You see how they both are sitting by the log? And just, and he doesn't go in that log. He sits on the side just like she does. And sometimes she will come over and she will go inside and he will come over there, and, but he does not enter. So I'm wondering if he's just too young or is he a female? Because sometimes I'm looking at him, I'm just not quite sure. Uh, the other one for sure I know is a female, but the smaller one, I am not sure yet. So I'm gonna have to just keep an eye and let time pass to, to re-examine and make sure that's a, a, a male there. But since I got the camera out too, this look, well, since uh, the heat is, index is higher, when it comes to these plecos, my high pen, high, high pen sisters, I add more oxygen to the tank. So I just wanted to see you guys to see that. I add a lot of extra bubbles in the summer and sometimes that helps to, to trigger a spawn in the summertime. So we're just gonna see if that works. But yeah, just wanted to give you guys a quick update on the new plecos in the fish room. And I got another video coming out pretty soon. So. Again, thank you for watching. Have a great day.